Welcome back. Today we've got another high point video. This is a JH45. This is a little bit different than the last uh, high point we did. This one's got a mag release on the bottom, which is not ergonomic at all. If you had to do a fast reload on it, you would probably just, you would lose for sure. Uh, it's an old one. We're going to shoot a uh, round loaded up with CFE 223 in it, where usually I run CFE pistol in my 45 ACP loads with 185 grain uh, Horn of the XTP jacket at hollow point. I'm not sure what it's going to do. <clears throat> it could be bad. It could just squib. It might shoot out of the barrel and shoot just fine. I have no idea. But we're going to find out today, and we'll go back here in a little while with the results. Yeah, that was really, uh, that wasn't exciting at all. Nothing happened. It just, just barely hurt it. When I, when the trigger pulled, I thought that we'd hear at least a bang. There was not even that. You hear the striker fire and that was it. It did nothing else. It squibbed pretty good. Like it's almost a perfect squib. So yeah, uh, using rifle powder in place of a pistol powder. I mean, you're going to get squibs with the CFE 223 in this case. I mean, all everything's different. I wouldn't say that you'll always get this exact same outcome, but yeah, it's it was totally uneventful. So uh, if you like this video, give us a thumbs up, subscribe, and we'll see you guys next time. All right, welcome back. Today we've got a high point, 45 ACP. It's another high point video, but this one is a JH45 instead of the JHP45. This one's got the mag release on the bottom. So if you had to do like a one-handed reload with it, which I'm... Yeah, just throw the gun at them. 